Uh, Say that again. Oh, this is the wood shop. Yeah. Back there is our kiln. It's used for ceramics. We do offer ceramics here to not only our staff, but some youth depending on the projects. And yeah, so we started off in this small space. In the beginning, beam was this space, which is an after school program. And it was an after school program for both little and older students, right? So that's why things are organized the way they are. Of course, BEAM has like changed now that we have gone into schools to where now the space is more directed towards older youth. A lot of youth we do work with, sometimes English isn't their first language. So we have now gone into where we wanna make the tools more visible more understandable so that they can actually feel and understand why it's a tool the way it is and what is its purpose. Because sometimes you can't communicate handsaw in Spanish or let's say even like Creole French. So it's trying to break that language barrier. It's an understanding barrier. And this is for a project that's going on called Work, Learn, Grow, where we're working with students and understanding measurements and conversions to make scale models. Right now they're making scale models of like the building that you're in now. They're working in groups and teams to like assess and do these things. And yeah, this is our wood shop. Everything had to be measured and understood to be placed where it is now with all the different variety of tools we have here. Mm -hmm. And then if you go through here, this is our main space. So the main space here is usually the space for congregation where we do icebreakers with the youth for apprenticeship programs because we feel like that's very important. Trying to break that awkwardness and bridge that gap. Back here is our tinker zone, meant for smaller electronical projects or even large scale electronical projects. Might it be from making a light turn on to someone fixing their phone and setting up all the hardware in there. And then the area you are spawned back here. This is the annex. And then the annex branch off to two different places. area over here covered by this white panel. That's there just to dry. We have a sewing machine there. That's our textile space. For students to create textiles or even let's say fix certain garments because that does happen here usually. And to the behind us is this area that I usually specialize in called the tinker zone. We have a vinyl cutter here for certain sensors, designs, even heat pressing on clothes. More of my domain back here, which is 3D printing and laser cutting, where we're making small creations or even things more on a larger scale. And a lot of the machines here are run by us, some youth, but also served by us and some youth. That one. And using this to make random things, like this was laser cut. And then spray painted by youth. This was made in Camp in New Hampshire, where we just put it over here. Just like cover the laser cutter. And the area to the behind to the left is just our that is just our office space. I think there's like a meeting going in. So Yeah. So uh this is the 
This is beam tender. This is the space. 